Okay, here we are today. Sewing. Finishing the book. Um, what I should do is paste these down. Yep. And then... Stuff. Uh, <laughs> shut up, Maria. So what I need to do is like place the pages where they're gonna go, roughly. Uh, and we're gonna mark. Where to sew up? Uh, you know, it might work better if we did this Whoop, on the other side. I don't actually need all of them there either. I just need one. And also try and do it without touching the paper. Good job, Maria. Thanks. Okay, so I'm just trying to center this paper. Hook that on there. We go that way we like that go over here mark where we're sewing we're gonna punch the holes go punch the top and the bottom then I think the middle the tutorial I've watched only does every other so it sews only in five places. And you know what? That guy knows what he's doing. So I may as well follow him. Obviously this is the top. But. I've made that mistake once already. So. Also I think I marked this on the wrong side of the paper. I'm past carrying. Um, I'm going to see if my other awl is smaller. So my sewing awl has a finer tip. So we're going to do that. Where's our piece of cardboard? Now, here's what we got to do. We gotta mark it on this side. Or, or, extend these marks. Okay. And, I like this. We're doing it easier. Sometimes I make things difficult on myself. Wait, wait, can I do this? Yeah. Send these marks to the other side and then check them to make sure they still work. Now, I don't have proper book binding thread either, so I'm just going to use sewing thread. So let's see. We're going to mark this. Do these line up? This one strikes me as being a bit high. So... We'll lower it a little. I just sneezed. It makes me all congested. I think, did I lower it? If I lowered it, it's like a tenth of a millimeter. This would be ridiculous. It's, here's where we're at. It's good enough at this point. 
So, then what we do, wait, we've set this up to be right-handed. Ugh! Gosh, I hate right-handed people. That's not true. I just hate that they make all the tutorials. Because what I want is to punch this way. Idea. New idea has taken shape. Put this here. Just like this. This doesn't line up. Let's start over. Okay, I'm using black paper. I can see the markings. This is it. So we have our cardboard. We're gonna go, I think, like this. I'm trying not to touch anything. I gotta find the middle of each of these. Put our little thing on here. See it, it hooks on the edge. Right here. And that's how I know where to push the holes. Come on. Everything is just so awkward right now. Why is this so awkward? Is this thing too long? This thing might be too long. Let's shorten it a little. It'll still hook. And maybe also shorten it this way. Okay. I made this hook skittier and shorter that way. And then we're gonna find the middle. needs to go like this. Why am I having such struggles? <laughs> Maybe I should just mark them with pencil and then come back and punch them. I'm like ruining the paper. Well, it works better if it's that way. Mmm. Mm. That is not insurmountable. I'm going to put these marks on the back. What would be good, actually? Is to uh, just like cut them out, if we're honest. How nice would that be? Oh, do you really? Just having a day, aren't I? Okay, open. Here. Hooked. And we're gonna come and punch our holes. where you are? Yeah. Everything is perfect. Come back here. I may need a bigger piece of cardboard. I think that's also not doing me any favors. Well, I just punched that hole. Oh no, it's in the right place. Okay, here we go. All our struggling got us five little holes. I'm gonna make them bigger. 
some of them aren't um, all the way through. So there's our holes for sewing. Now I just need to do that 200,000 more times, but maybe with a better piece of cardboard. I do have foam core. I don't, they're big pieces though. I don't wanna like deal with that. Got a better piece of cardboard. Well, better, I don't know, flatter. And a chair. And so here's what I do. Open it to the middle. Try not to struggle. Align that hooky bit that I that bends over at the top. Hate our lives, because now this thing is just giving us grief. And mark our holes. Let's see. Maybe if I do that. Okay. If I hold it up. You're trying to poke straight out. Like, if you had this open flat, I think you could poke straight down. But your ideal is at a 45 degree angle. So this is a pretty repetitive task, as you might imagine. Um, and this is a sort of a jig to make sure they all end up the same. Now, let's try sitting down. I feel like this is going to make me too short, but maybe it'll just make everything better somehow. I'm going to have to turn on a fan in a minute. Maybe I can do that. Come here. And then what I'll do is actually, rather than finish all of these as I should before moving on, we've got three. We can just start sewing and also then be excited about making that progress so then the rest of this doesn't suck as bad because we'll be like, yeah, but remember? Look at it, it's all coming together. Three signatures. Not even halfway. So, I, go, I glued these down a moment ago. And actually, before we can start sewing, the next step is to um, paste the thing. So, something that happens 
when you apply liquid is it'll cup so you can see this I think that it's curved outward that's because we put the, the liquid the, the glue on this so what we do when we put it here is we put the liquid the glue on this paper so my plan is I think I want to just cut this paper in half and hope that that gets me what I want. Mm -hmm. Does it measure an even number of millimeters? Not really. What if we do? Okay, so the luck, the hope, is that this covers, yeah, exactly what we want it to cover. So, this is a uh, tricky because I'm just using PVA. It's like Elmer's glue, but guaranteed to be acid free. And that is a uh, quick drying. So you get like one chance to put the paper down correctly. You're gonna just like, oh. Also this kind of got stuck in there. Totally legit way to use glue. Not totally legit. Too much glue. Oh God, too much glue. We're okay. Just scoop it off, Maria. It's fine. Nobody saw, you're not recording this for posterity. Don't tell Maria. Get off. Perfect. This has a glue on the front. Um, everything is just awesome. And actually, that worked out relatively okay. Except for the glue being in the cap now and other things. Lost. Oh, oh, I found my bone folder. I'm, um, this is a parchment paper, like for baking. And just doing this so that I don't mark up the underneath paper. Okay. Not bad. There's this. Right here, we're not going to worry about it.
Who would have thought that the thing that's the toughest for me is gluing? I mean, admittedly that's in part because I don't have the right tools. But at the same time, also, it just, I'm bad at it. What's funny is I like just cut my nails. If they had been longer, this might be easier. Okay. Well, hot dog. We did it. Okay. Gonna clean up some glue stuff now. I think between here, it's not glued down very well. So, I think I need to use more glue. See, rubbing like this makes it shiny. Um, so what I'm going to do now is punch all the holes in the paper for the sections, the signatures, and then we'll be back and start sewing it in.